In this video, I'm going to show you Foreigners Club in Sorrento. To get there, start in the main Tasso Square and look out for the front of Bar Ercolano, which has palm trees in front of it. You take the road that runs past it to the right, which is called Via Luigi de Meo. Follow this road after it runs sharply to the right and enter Sant Antonino Square, which is named after Sorrento's patron saint. With your back to the gardens, you take this road to the right, which is actually a continuation of Via Luigi Di Meo. You don't have to go far before you see the blue coloured sign for Foreigners Club on the right. It's just where this white van is pulling in. You keep to the left to get to the main entrance. On entering, you pass the tourist information office on the right, but you turn left. You walk past the bar, which is on your left, and emerge onto the terrace. This is called the Terrace of the Sirens, in reference to the sirens of Greek mythology, after which Sorrento is named. This setting is often used as a magnificent panoramic backdrop for wedding receptions. I am led to believe that during World War II, Allied soldiers took control of this breathtaking prime spot and created a bar where they could relax while off duty, and that this is how Foreigners Club got its name. Foreigners Club offers unforgettable panoramic views of the Bay of Naples, Mount Vesuvius and the Sorrento coast. It's a very pleasant place to eat lunch, have a few drinks and relax with friends and family while at the same time taking in the views. There's a good range of food to choose from at Foreigners Club, but I just love to have a pizza there. I think their pizzas are the best in town. I like to wash it all down with a nice cold beer, which, for me, is the perfect antidote to the Sorrento heat. Hey,